once I get some funds, I, I look at projects that I can spend it on. And I, I thought of Sophia because I think you have a lot of potential in this area. Uh, don't let people tell you what Sophia children can or cannot do, right? Because the world is opening up for you. And I have never gone to a camp and not seen the excitement of the children when they see those pieces that they can assemble. She was speaking to several youths in the community of Sapphire who will be participating in the STEM Robotics Camp 2019. The First Lady reminded that the STEM Robotics Initiative began in August of 2016 and recalled that the following year, a team represented Guyana at the first Global Robotics Olympics in Washington, D.C. in August 2017, where they came 10th out of 165 countries. The first study urged the participants to keep focused, noting that the lessons garnered will be profitable in the future. Think about it, and I, I keep telling the young ladies, I said the way it is going, the prediction is 90% of the work women do will become obsolete, which means they won't exist. So women who want to work and have money in their pockets must think about how they will get into this robot technology. Not just watching it work, but thinking about how it works and the functions you can have it perform, right? And that way you will be employed and getting enough money. Especially now as Guyana is developing, you can see it happening in so many ways, in agriculture, as I say, in the oil and gas sector. Neil Ledeman, InfoHub.